What is the difference between the democracy that the U.S. supported in Russia and the democracy that you have for yourselves? The system imposed on us under Yeltsin was what I would call a combination of chaos and anarchy. That's how it was for 97% of the population. The remaining 3% were beneficiaries of feudalism. These people lost the social, the people lost the social safety net they had uh, in the previous regime, and at the same time they were also losing jobs and whole industries were closed. Wages and pensions went unpaid for months and months. Meanwhile, like a feudal sovereign, Yeltsin was giving out the natural resources of the world's richest country to his vassals and cronies for a song. They, in turn, would not even pay taxes and would quickly send their ill-gotten fortunes offshore and other segments of our economy languished for lack of investment. And that's part of what U.S. taxpayer support bought in Russia. Your assistance went to people who could speak all the right textbook, textbook, textbook words in good English about freedom and democracy, about liberalism and free speech. But as it turns out, those people were con consistently dismantling democratic institutions and eroding checks and balances.